So hey guys, i am been cleaning my room and so I decided to make this video about how much of a flake I am when it comes to video games. I've uh, put video games that I haven't played in three different piles here. The ones that I bought this year, the ones I bought last year, and then the ones that I don't know when the hell I bought them. Um, let's start with this year. Uh, I bought this game, Kuan. Uh, for how much? Five bucks, apparently. And, yeah, about that. When I was out of town. And, I didn't play it right away because, you know, I was away from my, um, PlayStation. And I just haven't got around to it. Uh, I've actually started playing this, so I should probably take it out of this list. Or pile, whatever. Um, yeah, I just bought this not too long ago and started playing it, so yeah, nothing to say about that. Final Fantasy 13. I actually never finished Final Fantasy 10. Uh, Final Fantasy uh, 11, I think, was an MMO, so screw that. 12, I didn't like the fighting style, and I bought this for some unknown reason. I guess because Square Enix owns my soul, I don't know. And, yeah, I'll get around to it one of these days, but not anytime soon. Star Ocean. Uh, I like the second Star Ocean. I played a little bit of the third. I don't think I ever finished it, though. Um, I've never played the first one. Uh... So, yeah, this is still in its packaging. I'm pretty sure I bought it the same day. I bought Final Fantasy XIII. But, yeah. I'll play it one of these days. Probably when I finish the third one. I got, you know, too wrapped up in, like, making those foods and stuff. You know, like, the, the little, um... Like, they have, like, this little kitchen thing where you can, like, make foods and then patent it. And then you get, like, a discount at the shops for it. Yeah, I was doing that for like 10,000 years. Never got back to the story. Anyway, Alan Wake. I bought that a couple of days ago. No, a couple of weeks ago, actually. Uh, my brother played it before I did. And he like took it away from me and started playing it. But anyway, here it is. And I'll play that eventually. But uh, I don't know when I'll play that. At some point. I might play it after I finish Alice. I don't know. Okay. Then the games I played last year. Or no, not played. Bought. Uh, Odin Sphere. Mm, don't really know what this game's about or why I felt the need to buy it, but there it is. <laughs> uh, I also have a game in this pile that's... Oh yeah, this one. It's by the same people. Muramasa. The Demon Blade. About I got this for my birthday last year. My mom gave it to me. But yeah, never get around to it. It's on the Wii. I hate the. That's why I never finish a lot of Wii games because the damn controller needs batteries. We don't have like a char a Wii Mote charger, so batteries are hard to come by for some reason around here in this house so I always get somewhere and just like uh, do we have any batteries uh, no dang it uh Lord of the Rings I bought this somewhere around the time I was playing that god awful GBA game and I never played this cause that game scarred me so much that I'm afraid to play any other Lord of the Rings games except for of course that text based game that I was playing and I decided to stop that so I can brush up on my, you know, readings. So I started rereading this, but then I, I was like, I got to, like, a sh shortcut to mushrooms or something. One of the chapters. And I was just like, you know what? If I'm going to reread this, I might as well reread The Hobbit. So that's on hold, and so it's the uh, text based game. Uh, yeah, Lord of the Rings. Uh, I don't know if that's any good. 
That's why I haven't played it. Uh, no More Heroes. I got that either from for my birthday or Christmas. I'm not sure. And it... I don't know who gave it to me. Somebody. Maybe it was my brother. I don't know. Now for Christmas, I got this for Christmas last year. Um, I'm gonna wait. A, I'm probably gonna play it in a couple of months, but I don't know. I'll think about it. Uh, Christmas time, no, November-ish, maybe. I don't know. Uh, this resident. My mom gave me this for my. Birthday Christmas. I can't remember. My birthday and Christmas are close together, so I don't really know. But, um. The. It's the GameCube remake of Resident Evil. I got it last year. And, uh. Yeah. Didn't really. Haven't played it yet. Uh, my brother got me this for my birthday. It's in a tin box. Interesting. Tin box. But. Yeah, so, so here's another game that I didn't play. Okay, those are the games that I bought last year, or bought or got last year. These are the games that I bought this year. And then finally, the games that I don't know when the hell I bought them. Who the... I probably had them for decades. Anyway, The World Ends With You. I bought that... I don't know. And these DS Kingdom Hearts. I got one of them last year. One of them I got before that, I think. But I don't know. Um, then... Uh, let's see. Oh yeah, the Emily the Strange game. I, th I think it was last year. Or it was earlier this year. No, 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 no. I think it was last year. And I bought it because, you know, Emily. Love Emily. You can check out my bookcase over here. You can see a bunch of Emily books. I'm missing a couple, I think. I don't know if they're in my room somewhere or if I don't have them. I'll have to check my, like, Amazon, like, things that I've ordered, but anyway, so yeah, Emily, I'm a big Emily the Strange fan, my, like, little light switch in my door is a Emily the Strange thing, but anyway, uh, then Blue Dragon Plus, I haven't played that because it's a tactical RPG, and I hate tactical RPGs with a passion, so yeah. Uh, Devil May Cry. I bought this because, for apparently eight bucks, because my mom refused to buy it for me. Because, uh, like, that thing right there. And this was back in the day, mind you, when I couldn't buy those. But, uh, so I bought it myself, and, uh, they just handed it over, I guess. They didn't say, hey, wait, are you 17? Can you buy this game? I guess they didn't give a damn. Uh... So yeah, it's been sitting here. My brother's played it. I, I, I'm kind of pissed because my mom wouldn't buy me this. Wouldn't buy it for me. But my brother played it, and I didn't. And so, my mom subsequently bought him all of the sequels when he wanted them. She's like, he was like, I really like this game. Can I have the second one and the third one and who God knows how many other sequels there were? And she was like, okay, here you go. And just like, what? I had to buy this much. Oh, yeah. uh, <laughs> Shadow of the Classes. I actually did start to play this, but I got, like, I was running around for a couple of days. Just, you know, killing lizards and things. And then, finally, I found the Colossus. I think it's this dude on the cover, actually. And, um, he proceeded to kick my ass up one side and down the other and so that was the end of that I lost horribly 
and then maybe a few months later I was just like you know what I'm gonna try that my hand at that again so I was like you know killing more lizards and stuff for more grip and things like that and then he kicked my ass again and so I never played it again after that and so here we are just sitting in my room chaos legion I actually played no I actually bought this game twice and then never played it I bought it once and I put it in the PlayStation 2 and the thing said oh the disc it's broken or this ain't a real disc what the hell what are you trying to pull and so I was like huh so I went back there and they were like uh, you uh, we don't have any more of this game do you want something else in turn and I was like okay so I picked up some crap I don't know what it was probably with my luck uh, dot hack which is should be in this list somewhere but that ain't never gonna get played I didn't like it but anyway uh so yeah so then at some point later I found the Chaos Legion at another game store and it was like hey that's that game that I wanted to play way back wins and so I bought it again and here it sits Fatal Frame 3 why haven't I played this even though Fatal Frame 2 is like my favorite game, you know, uh, I don't know. Paid like 35 bucks for it used. And, uh, oh, yeah, 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 I remember why. I wanted to, to do this game blind for my channel. But then all that crap started happening with the desktop computer and with the Dazzle and. So I never got around to it, and I'm still thinking I can. I'm still thinking of holding off on playing this so I can do it blind for my channel, but. And I think I'll probably do it together with the fourth one because I'm getting that at some point. I don't have it yet, but I am gonna get it. I don't care. If I have to pay, who knows, God knows how much for it, but I am getting it. And I also need the first one for the PlayStation 2. I have the first one for the Xbox. Problem is, I don't have an Xbox. <laughs> I've got an Xbox 360, but they can't really play Xbox games that well. The lag on, on Jet Set Radio is just horrible. Um... So yeah, I can, I, I'll probably invest in an in a original Xbox at some point, but not anytime soon. Um, Obscure Two, I bought it for four bucks apparently, and um, it's originally or marked down to eleven at some point. I got it for four. Um, Obscure Two, I'm pretty sure I bought this right after I beat the first one, which. I don't know when that is. I'll have to look at the... Probably 2009? I don't know. I'll have to look at the date on the videos. But, um... Maybe 2010. I don't know. So, yeah. I am going to play this, though. For my channel. There's Stan. Slim Shady's number one fan. And some other douchebags that are probably going to die. No, no, no. I'm... They're going to live if I can help it. Because we're keeping Stan throughout the entire game. Like we did last time. Uh, not being, you know... Josh, or whatever the hell his name was. I don't remember the other people. I really don't. I have the memory of a goldfish. But anyway, so yeah, I'm going to play this. For my channel. Hell, I might have played... I don't know. I'll play it. Uh, Silent Hill 2. I don't know why I haven't played this. I think it's because I never finished the first one. I'm going to go with that. Never finished the first one, so can't really start up the second one now, can I? Except for 
the uh, this thing right here, but we'll get to that in a minute. Uh, so yeah, I think that's the reason. Uh, you want, and I recently saw Silent Hill 3, the, the Xbox 360, I think, and I was just like, oh my god, I gotta buy that, and it'll end up in the, one of these piles, until I finish that first one. Anyway, here we go. I know when I bought this, even though it's in the pile of, I don't know when the hell I bought these games. I bought this almost 11 years ago. When it come out? Uh, 2000, 2002? No, two th 2001? Yeah, I think so. So yeah, almost 11 years ago is when I bought this game. And I have not played it. I'm probably going to play it now since when I bought this one, it came as a download. Uh, but on the Xbox. So now this disc here just kind of taking up space but maybe I'll play it on the computer for the hell of it after I finish that one but I don't know so yeah I've been playing this even though I've never I, I didn't play this I, I, I got the gist of what happens so oh. okay uh I don't know when about this half life uh, even though it says King's Quest on the back here, I don't know, what the hell, let's see, uh, the disc is Half-Life, but I don't know, um, yeah, this is one of those games that everybody and their brother just plays, except for me, so, that's probably why I have it, but, um, yeah, I should probably play it, just so it can be official, everybody and their brother has played it when I do. Uh, so yeah, I don't know when I'll do that, but King's Quest. I wish there it was actually. I'm gonna have to look up this King's Quest game to see what the hell's about. Cause why is the back? They're a totally different box. Oh well. Um, yeah, probably end up playing this. Make it official. Everybody and their brother. Oh, yeah, and finally, Grim Fandango. I actually feel like playing this, you know, this time of year. Around Halloween, because it's, you know, skeletons. And, uh, Day of the Dead and all that. Um,. So, I, I, I'm probably gonna, after this video is done, check, put it in my computer, see if it works. Because, oh, there's kind of glare for some reason. Oh, yeah, it's this. Uh, the. Yes, put it in my computer, see if it works. Because it says Windows 95 down there. It's too blurry to see, but it does say that. And. Yeah, that was a long time ago. So, hopefully you'll play, and I can do this for my channel. Uh, yeah. So, that's all I wanted to say. Now, these are this are the games that I've, you know, n never played. Th there's a whole other list of games that I. Um, but I started to play, but I never finished. Um, what's in that list? No, well, Star Ocean 3, but, oh, and Beyond Good and Evil, I never finished the final boss, and that, he just kicked my ass, and so, yeah, that's the thing with me, when there's a really hard final boss that's like ten times harder than anything else in the entire game. Like, it's been like a breeze up until that point, and then they just like slam you with like this uber boss. It's just, it really pisses me off, and 
I sit there and I fight it and I fight it and I fight it and I keep dying and then I just shuck the game into the abyss and it's just like screw you game you can go straight to hell that's kind of what happened with that Hocho Sojo game there aren't, there's not gonna be any more of those videos because I cannot beat that nightmare boss he is just too hard so if there's another ending out there I'm just gonna have to like look it up or something because I can't beat that guy and I'm not gonna try anymore I've tried like 10,000 times to beat him and it's just not happening so uh yeah so yeah I'll try and do that game probably end up doing that at some point though I suck at those kind of games so it's probably gonna be uneasy if they have an easy mode or it's going to be really shitty with me dying 10,000 times in that if it doesn't uh and yeah so that's it uh here's my flakely with the games again and yeah I'll see you guys next time